Good day everyone, my name is Alex and welcome back. In today's video I'm gonna show you how to install the Google Play Store on the latest Amazon Fire tablet. This should also work on the 5th and 6th generations. The whole process takes under 5 minutes and all you have to do is follow my step-by-step -step instructions. With that being said, let's begin. Alright, so first you're gonna have to go to settings. At settings you're gonna have to go to security. At security you're gonna have to turn on um, apps from unknown sources. You're gonna get this warning, just press OK. And this step it's done. Next you're gonna have to open the browser and you're gonna find the link in the video's description and basically enter that link in the browser. So this is gonna be the link that you have to enter. So just click on that and open it. And as soon as you open it uh, this will uh, show up. Next we are gonna install these one by one. So let's start with the first one. So just click on the first one then click on those three dots uh, right here and uh, click open in a new window. And as soon as this happens, just click download. And you're gonna see it right here at the bottom. Just press OK and wait for it to download. And press open. Just uh, press install. And press done. Close this tab and go back to your first uh, tab there. And you can just press refresh uh, on the first tab. And you're gonna go back to this, click on the second one. Again, click on those three dots um, do right there. Click open in a new window. And click download. And you're gonna click OK. And just wait until um, it's done downloading. And press open. Go next, next, and install. And just give it a second. And now that uh, it's done, just press done. So you can close that uh, tab on top, go back to the first one and just press refresh. And you're gonna click on the third one. Once again, um, we're gonna click on the three dots right there, open this in a new tab and just click download. Click OK right here at the bottom and open. Click next, next and install and just give it a second and click done. Once again you can close that uh, tab on top and go back to the first one and press refresh and you're gonna click on the fourth one and once again we click on those three dots and download and click OK and open click next and install. Okay, so now um, it's done. Just click done. And now you can go back to your home screen. So you're gonna see the Google Play Store um, right there. Next, you're gonna do a tablet restart. So just uh, power off the tablet and then power it back on. This video was made possible thanks to the Zito Top cases for the Amazon Fire Tablet 8. There are over 23 models to choose from and aside from protecting your tablet, they also give it a very unique look. If you wanna check out any of these cases, you can find the link in the video's description. Once the tablet is back on, you have the Play Store right here, so you can go ahead and open the Play Store and give it a second. That could take up to a minute depending on your internet connection. If you don't get to this screen within a minute, just exit the app, so like this, uh, open the multitasking, swipe this out, so close it and open it once again. And then you should uh, get to this screen uh, much faster. Once you're here, just enter your uh, Gmail account and password and sign in. After you signed in, um, you're gonna get to this screen and it's gonna take maybe 30-40 seconds. Click next. You don't have to set up uh, any payment information. Go to continue. 
and here you go now you have the google play store um, installed and now you can just go and install uh, whatever apps um, you want from the google play store most of the apps are gonna work fine but um, you may find a game or two that um, aren't gonna work but it really depends on the games that you're looking for and there you have it it was that simple to install the google play store on the amazon fire tablet all right guys hopefully you enjoyed this video if you did like it press that like button don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you in the next one thanks for watching